having a bit of a play with my induction heater. I've made a new coil, which this one's about one and a half microfarads, and then uh, micro Henry, sorry, and then the cap bank here, which is made of two different types, but uh, adds up to 3.29 microfarads and gives me a resonant frequency of around 70 kilohertz. I'm using this coupling transformer, so the cap bank and uh, heating element are actually completely floating and then that's just being driven straight from a FOT MOSFETs here uh, which I'm currently using my function generator and just using that to find the, where the best current is. Uh, I've got my multimeter set up, one's on a current shunt so I can see how much current's going in, the other one's telling me the voltage and uh, this Variac which is uh, rated for 2 kVA um, I was blowing the fuse on my other little um, Variac. Unfortunately this one's only 110 volts so I'm just using this toroid to step it straight down to there. Oh it's actually 100 it gets but I haven't um, got that for the output yet. I've only gone up to about 70 volts out. But uh, made my little graphite thing there hot enough to burn the desk. You know, I just have to figure out a way to put those on something so they don't burn anything and uh, you know, give it another go. See if I can melt something. Oh yes, that's melted very easily. It's not even up to the temperature it's going to get to. This is uh, pewter that I bought from the art supplies shop. Look at it go. Well, now I need something to pour it into. It's uh, about 45 degrees. Not bad. The beautiful thing about this is the coil is cool to the touch. And in there we have my molten pewter. No longer molten, but yes, a success.